Hey, how's it going, everyone? We're playing some more Pokemon Emerald. We're getting into our first contest here, so let's get started. Hello! We're just getting started with a normal rank Pokemon beauty contest. The participating trainers and their Pokemon are as follows. Entry number one, Alex Slokoff. Yeah, it's not that beautiful. Get that out of my face. Can't even stand up. Entry number two, Chances R Rykelek? Okay, pretty cool. Pretty cool. No problem. Pages Seal. See, no, this belongs in the cuteness category, not beautiful category. That thing is slimy and it's drooling. And then, of course, the obvious winner here. Dave's Pajamas. We've just seen the four Pokemon contestants. Now it's time for primary judging. The audience will vote on their favorite Pokemon contestant. Come on, bro. What? This isn't even a competition. Without any further ado, let the voting begin. Like, we got a... A fat seal, a sloth, and Matrix. Like, okay, yeah, that's cool, but I wouldn't consider it beautiful. I'd consider it cool. Voting is now complete. While the voters are being tallied, let's move on to the secondary judging. The second stage of judging is the most anticipated appeal time. May the contestants amaze us with superb appeals of dazzling moves. Let's see a little enthusiasm. All right, which move will be played? Oh, okay. What is it? Cool. Man, none of these actually work for in my favor. Guess let's do confusion. Feel the roar. Yeah, I don't really have any moves specifically for beauty. Hmm. <laughs> oh well. Uh, okay, we'll see what happens. Aura Beam? That is a beautiful move, I gotta give it that. Oh! Dang. Yeah, let's give them all you got. Hmm. Oh! Oh! Oof! Alright. Bro, shut up. I don't have any beautiful moves, I'm sorry. Didn't stand out very much. Yeah, I don't have I didn't I didn't have any moves, man. Dude. I don't have many good moves for this. Ugh. Zap, zap, zap. Okay, seal. Take those hearts away. <laughs> Thunder is being ignored. Alright, Gardevoir. Fusion again. I tried to startle the other Pokemon. Okay. Oh, I can't repeat them? What? Hey, I have that move too. Put down on the distraction. Hmm. I think Slokoth might have taken that one. Hmm. Let's do this one. I still don't even know how this whole system works, so I'm going to be 100% with you. I was kind of hoping I win. Okay, give him a little growl. Another Aurora Beam. That's a repeat move. It's a repeat move. Strike him down. Strike him down. What? 
pajamas. Don't look down. Oh my god. He already did that move. No fair. He already did it. Or maybe, do you only get penalized if you do it two in a row? Startle the other Pokemon. Alright. Pajamas. Pajamas, what are you doing, dude? What are you doing? Mm, man, I am not doing very good right now. Um, Alright, back to confusion, I guess. Dude, if I lose, I'll be so sad. Like, how is this a beauty contest and Gardevoir doesn't win? Tell me the sloth. Really? Alright. Alright. Trying to startle the other Pokemon. Hmm. Water gun. Oh my god, he's. He feels. Ugh, doing it, bro. He's doing it. Maybe we can take Sfeel out here. Like, yeah, yeah, get, 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 get rid of some of those hearts. Judge looked at pajamas expectedly. Oh, stop it. Are my stock? Yeah, my stock went up a little bit, though. Dude, how many appeals do we have, man? Do we go until someone reaches, like, the full health bar? Paired with these good moves. Water gun, Aurora Beam. Man. Of course, he gets another heart for that, too. Psychic. Let's see what this does. Okay. Oh. Ah. We'll take it down a couple notches. Wait. Oh. Wait, don't, don't, I don't lose a heart over that, right? Okay, good. Okay, we're somehow in first place now. Who won? That's it for judging. Thank you all for the, for the most wonderful display of quality appeals. Concludes all judging. Thank you for your fine efforts. I think Sfeel might have won. Now, all that remains is the pulse-pounding proclamation of the winner. The judge looks ready to make the announcement. We now declare the winner. Announcing the results. What? Really? Wait, what? I mean, I guess I got second place. Oh, dang it, man. Yeah, look, I could probably smash this contest if I knew what moves were, like, you know, for beauty. Okay. Alright, well, hey, that was our first one ever. Second place for our first one. I'll take it. And we were pretty, we were pretty close, you know? We, we were close, we were close. Um, alright. Let's move on. There is one, so, May. Oh, hey, Dave, are you shopping too? I bought a whole bunch of dolls and posters. Of course, I've also caught a lot of Pokemon, and I'm raising them properly too. Actually, I'm more worried if you're raising Pokemon properly, Dave. I'll battle with you so you can show me your Pokemon. All right, the Pokemon I raised won't be beaten by your Pokemon, Dave. Let's see about that, dude. All right, May. What do you got for me? Four? Tropius. I still don't have any form of fire Pokemon to really fight back. Okay, this won't be very effective, but I think three of these will probably kill. It's probably... Oh, that doesn't do anything. Never mind, that sucks. 
trying to think who I should bring in for this. You know what? I feel like we've ne we we've kept Bluey. We've given Bluey the XP share, but we've never fought with it. Altaria, come out here, bro. Let's do let's do a little fighting. Let's see what you got. Dragon Breath? Astonish? Yeah. Let's do a little Dragon Breath. Oh, what do you got, huh? What do you got for me? Okay, that didn't do anything. What about flying? Stomp, you missed your stomp. Because you suck. Bop. Oh, yeah. Let's go, Bluey. Taking care of them one by one. Pelipper. Okay, let's go back to Salad because it's a grass type. Or, not grass type, it's a, it's a water type, right? Or is it just pure flying? I'm pretty sure it's a water type because we find it in the ocean. I always forget these types of things. Let's go and go with the Leaf Blade here. You can protect yourself now. But you just wait, okay? Give me one more turn. And that stupid smile of yours won't be there for much longer. Bro, come on. Really? And watch, he's even now he's gonna use the Hyper Potion. Psych, he's just gonna use Protect again. Alright, well, now he's gonna use Hyper Potion. Seriously? Again? Alright. Now he's gonna use Hyper Potion. Alright. Maybe, I guess maybe she's saving the Hyper Potion for her later Pokemon? I, I don't really know. Combuskin. Okay. Let's bring in Pajamas. Salad is not built to fight a fire type right now. I'm surprised May still has a Combuskin. I would have thought she... Oh, it's two levels away. Okay, so the next fight with May will likely be Blaziken. Is Combuskin fire type yet, or is only is only Blaziken a fire type? Okay, yeah, Combuskin must must be a, fi a fighting type already. Liticolo, Fluticolo, we'll, we'll stay with pajamas. That's fine. He has to hit him with another psychic. Yeah, she's got a cool bunch of Pokemon. I'll give her that. Super effective. Didn't hurt that much, though. No hyper potions or anything from her. That's weird. Alright, dent to 34. I remember the battle I had with you, Dave. On Route 103, the battle helped you become this strong, Dave, didn't it? $2,000. May, I'm thinking of going back to Little Root soon. I've caught a decent group of Pokemon, and my Pokedex is coming along. I'm going home to show my dad. Dave, what are you going to do? Collect all the gym badges and take the Pokemon League challenge? Well, while you're collecting badges, Dave, I'm going to work on my Pokedex. I'm completing it before you. See you. Hey, don't worry, man. I'm working on my Pokedex, too. Alright, department store. We should be able to buy a lot of cool stuff here. Welcome to the department store. This is the lottery corner. All shoppers at our department store get to draw a Pokemon lotto ticket. The lotto tickets number matches the ID number of any of your Pokemon. You will receive a fabulous gift. Would you like to draw? Yes, please. Okay. The lotto ticket number is 192. Need to run a check on this to see if it matches any of your Pokemon's ID. Please wait. I'm sorry, none of the numbers match. Please do visit again. Okay. I'm always end up buying all sorts of things because it's so fun. Okay. Let's go uh, st store by store here. I'm leaving. Okay. Let's see. What do you got? Potions. Mech mail. Okay, let's buy one of these. We'll need it for somebody. What do you mean I have no more... Do I have to sell stuff again? Okay, let's sell some stuff. Okay, so I can sell... Oh, I can sell both of these nuggets. Okay. Let's 
see. What else can I sell? Um, no, not that. Hmm. I mean, probably a lot of these things. I really should pro- I don't know why I bought so many of each. Let's just have, like, one on us at all times. Antidote. Yeah, let's just have one. It's kind of annoying, but, like, I need to have room for other stuff. Super repels. Nah, I want to keep all those, because I'll probably need them pretty soon. Alright, I think we could buy a few more things now. Um, wave mail. Okay, let's buy one of this. Let's buy a few max repels. Okay. Also, I just realized... I don't think my bag is filled by a total number of items. My bag is filled by the amount of different types of items. So I potentially just sold a bunch of those heals for no reason, I think. I'm thinking about it logically now, but oh well. Pokeball, Great Ball, Ultra Ball. See, like, I could buy a bunch of Ultra Balls here and I wouldn't fill up my bag anymore. It's just the amount of different types of items, right? It's not about how many you have of one. I think. So I could buy 20 million ice heals. It only takes up one slot in my bag. Okay. Well, anyway, we don't need any more of this stuff. But, yeah. Eh, it's kind of dumb on my part, but it's okay. Let's go to floor two. Or floor three, please. Let's go to three. And we'll check out floor by floor. So first floor is lobby, second floor is healing items of, yeah, like he healing items. Um, okay, so this is buffs. Uh, wait, no, I want to be served, please, I want to be served. Okay, this is all trash. Okay, so this is the most useless floor of all. Do not need any of your stuff. Let's go to floor four. Okay, um, that was a hint. This is probably TMs. Okay. That that first one's probably protect. Um. What do you have? Ooh, fire attack. Thunderbolt. Ooh, okay, you know what? I want this. It's brutal snow and wind attack. Buy this too. I don't know what it is, but I want both of those. Oh. Yeah, so it's probably spent a little bit more money than I should have there, but oh well. Hmm. Okay. Alright, let's check out the last floor. And do, is there a floor with like evolution items or something? Okay, so posters or a secret hideout that I could make. How about you? So, okay, I don't really know what that stuff does. Cute mats, okay. Is this all just like house stuff? It might be, yeah, just dolls and... Is there not like a person that sells like evolution stones or something? Okay, so I guess that's it for the department store. What I think what we should do is head over to the Safari Zone finally. Now, next video will be the dedicated Safari Zone video. But obviously the Safari is going to take an episode or two to get through to catch everything. So let's just go there right now and get the ball started if you know what i mean so let's do this let's do this let's do this all right one entry por favor yes let's do this i've got it pulled up at what we can encounter 
Well, you know when your game. Yeah, so until then, is your. Uh, okay. Alright. Let's do this. It's Safari Zone, baby. Good luck. If you need anything, don't hesitate to tell me. Okay, so we only get 500 steps. You gotta remember that. You guys, like, don't fight me, right? <laughs> okay. What? Oh, what? Oh, that's cool. I can put food in that? Oh. Giraffe rig? Wait, why isn't that on my list? Okay, everybody. I think I've figured out, like, the zoning and the Pokemon. So, the Pokemon on the this side should reflect what we can find here. Okay. So, let's try to go near. Is watching carefully. I'm chucking a ball. Zero patience. Hold this. Crap! It's gonna it's gonna run. Another ball. Oh, come on! So close. Oh, it's gonna run. Oh, crap, dude. Okay, can I? Do I even have any? I literally don't even have any. Wait. Yeah, I don't even... Well, I don't have any. Okay, here we go. Um, I don't know. Can I just keep running in this same patch? I don't think it matters. Another draft ring. Okay, so we get another shot here. Oh, okay. Well, let's just use this fireball off rip. <laughs> that was an accident, but... Watching carefully. Let's go a little near. Darn it, dude. Dude, move out of my way. What is this guy doing? He just. What are you? It's like lineman blocked me. Go to him. Okay. This is a 10% spawn, so actually, this could be pretty cool to catch. Let's go near and throw a ball. Watching carefully. We keep throwing. We keep throwing. Alright. Our first Pokemon Safari catch, which is a Doduo. 10%. You know, not the worst one. Even while eating or sleeping, one of the head remains always vigilant for any sign of danger. When threatened, it flees at over 60 miles per hour. Okay. Um... I don't know why I want to name him, like, a Taco Bell name. Like, I, I don't... Maybe I'm hungry. That's probably it. I'm just hungry. I'm gonna name you Chalupa. I don't know how to spell Chalupa. Ch Lu Chalupa. Alright, your name makes no sense, but we're gonna go... We're gonna go with Chalupa. Alright, well, let's, dude, that guy needs to stop blocking me. He's just standing there menacingly. Whoa, 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 This is the rare. This is the rare. It's of the 5%. I'm not playing games. I'm just gonna throw a ball right away. Please? Dude, let's... Let's freaking go, dude. Off rip. The rare 5% Pikachu. Dude, you absolutely love to see that. It stores electricity in the electrical sacks on its cheeks when it releases pent-up energy in a burst of electric power equal to a lightning bolt. Dude, how cool is that? Um, what do we name it? I'm gonna name you Cheeks. Do we already have someone else named Cheeks? I'm pretty sure I might have someone else named Cheeks. But you have these electrical sacks on your cheeks, that's why I want to name it Cheeks. Okay, I don't know if someone else's name Cheeks, but po this the Pikachu is the new Cheeks. Okay, so we still got... So we got Pikachu, which is the rare. Wobbuffet, another 10%. Okay, we'll take the 10%. I, I, don't, look, I don't know the best strategy for these Safari Zones, but honestly, I'm kind of in the mood to just start chucking balls. It's watching. Yeah, like just, I just keep chucking balls. Everything will be fine. This one doesn't look like it'll be caught as easy. I'm just gonna be honest. We'll keep throwing. We'll figure it out. Mm. 
gonna run. Oh, you're still watching, huh? Okay. Oh. Still watching. Alright, well, if you're still watching, I'll still be throwing. Did we ever catch that giraffe for it by chance? I already. F it's gonna run now. Yeah. I was like, that was, that was one too many ball throws. I forgot if I already caught the giraffe rig. I have short term memory, bro. Oddish, I love you. Don't. Okay, I didn't mean to throw that. I, I do not need another Oddish. I mean, if you want to stay in the ball, I won't say no. Sure, Oddish. Come home with me. I don't need you. Um, but. Sure, alright. Okay. Still. Draft rig. I didn't catch you yet, did I? No, I didn't think so. On the. Oh, I. You know what I should mention? The fact that I hate the Pokemon Giraffe Rig. It's. It's up there in my list of least favorite Pokemon. Uh, Giraffe Rig was caught, and of course it just catches so easily. But yeah, I do not like Giraffe Rig. I think it's like a weird and stupid design that makes. I, I just don't like it. I, I don't like it, okay? I don't know why I dislike it so much, but it's. It's in like my top 10, like, hated Pokemon. Uh, Giraffe Rig is a herbivore. It eats grass and tree shoots while it is eating. Its tail makes chewing and swallowing motions as if it were also eating. Okay. Not gonna name you. Not gonna use you. Not gonna look at you. You're gonna stay in the box, and it is what it is. Something, I don't know. Something about its, about its design just makes me angry, and I don't know why. Alright, Webbuffet. Man, we almost got everything here. Pikachu, Oddish. Bloom we don't need. Dodo we caught. So we just need Natu, Natu, and Webbuffet. That's it. Yeah, done, 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 done. Natu, done. Okay, yeah, Natu, Natu, and Webbuffet. They're both ten percent, which kind of sucks. But um, yeah, we'll find them. They they seem to show up. Like these guys aren't like crazy rare. So really, the the one that was was going to be the hard one was the Pikachu, but we got very lucky with it, so. Hey, man, how about you just keep holding these balls for me? That'd be cool. Man, it's one of it's hard to catch. And this guy does not, like, play around or anything. Yeah, like, not even a, sh not even a shake, nothing, just... Wow. Dude. Alright, well, well, we'll keep chucking. Yeah, I don't know, does this one just have like a lower catch percentage compared to the others? I Even the other ones never broke out of the balls like this consistently. Man. Yeah. Well, we'll keep trying, we'll keep trying. And I think... Not to, there's the other one. There, the, for this video, we'll likely just finish out Zone 1 or Area 1. In the next video, we'll go to the, all the other zones. Don't, please don't run. Please don't run, not the first time. Okay, good. Alright, alright. Please, please, not to. You're a good bird, please. Almost gotcha, almost gotcha. Please. Pretty please. With sprinkles on top. Let's go, baby. Alright, we're just hunting that Wubbuffet now. That's the only one we're hunting. It runs up short trees that grow on the savannah to peck at new shoots. Anatu's eyes look as if they are always observing something. Alright, I'm gonna call you P. Not like Yeah. Yeah, like the like the like the vegetable. Cause he looks like a little green pea. Little cute pee. Wobbuffet. Alright, see, now I feel like since Wobbuffet's the last one, it is now going to torture me. Like, it's gonna. I'm never gonna find it again. Or it's gonna take me forever to. Yeah. Honestly, I'll, I will give this to the game. Up until now, I've gotten pretty lucky with encounters. Like, very, very lucky with encounters, but this Wobbuffet's gonna torture me now. Oh, Gloom? I mean, 
Yeah? We get hit up a little gloom action. I won't say no to it. I only have six balls left. You know what, let's try to go near. Let's let's play around with it. No, okay. Well, I tried. You know, what more can you do than try? What about that? Alright, how many balls though we got? I think we only have like three. I right, try to go near. Ball? Please don't run. We got three left. Dude, it'd be so cool if we caught it. So cool. So we could just fin finish out area one, you know? Without having to restart the whole thing. Boba Fett. Alright, we only got two balls. That's all we got. Let's try to go closer again. Okay. We only got two balls. Fingers crossed. No, dude, you, you tease. You're, you're teasing me. I only got one ball left. Is it even worth trying to hunt down a Wubbuffet for the chance of only hitting it once? Wubbuffet. All right. Well, we only have a single ball, so... Let's go in here again. All right, single ball. This would be a fairy tale story ending if we caught it. Nah, too good to be true. Too good to be true. All right, well, I mean, I guess we just catch the Wubba Fett next time because he is in a few other areas. All right, well, I tried to provide you guys with a fairy tale ending of catching everything in Area One. But sadly, we'll have to do that next time. But guys, next video will be a dedicated Safari Zone video, which will try to catch everything. So I'm excited. You guys should be excited. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. I'll see you guys next video.